Hi guys, I have been shopping. I went with a few friends into town yesterday and I went to Primark and Superdrug and some other places and I thought I would show you what I've bought. I haven't been shopping in quite a while so I went a little bit mad. New look first. Now if you guys don't know already, I love New Look. I think their Inspire range is really good um, for a bigger girl. Ooh. Maybe I'm getting heavier. Um, it's just well fitting and it looks really cute and I like all the floral things which in style at the minute. So I bought, dun 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 dun. How do I do this? I bought this, which is a really cute skater dress. Um, it's got short sleeves and it goes in a little bit of the waist. It gives you a bit more of a waist and it flows out and it's really cute and flowery and pretty. And it was only £18 and I get a student discount, so 10% off that, and I thought it was really good value for what it was. I just think it would look really cute with some leggings and a cardigan and some cute boots. The next place I went into was House of Fraser. I don't usually go into there that much when I'm in Leicester because um, I don't think it's got uh, a lot of things for me. Um, mainly just makeup but I tend to go to Debenhams here or Superdrug um, but I went in there and we were having a look around just being nosy and I found a Yankee candle now you guys know how much I love Yankee candles they're my favourite kind of candle I think they smell really great I've got this one which is the Sicilian Lemon and it was on sale from 19 99 to 13 99 when I was little, I used to have these yellow sweets and it smells exactly the same as that. And I just think it'd be a really nice fresh smell for spring. It'd be quite nice to have burning um, in the summer evenings, making it smell nice and fresh and pretty. We then went to Primark and they gave me a really big bag. And I don't think I needed a big bag, but there we go. I bought this, which is a little mirror, if you open it up there, and it's really big and magnified, which is good for when you're putting your makeup on, and it only cost me a pound. Um, I thought I'd get it because my old one is covered in makeup, and it's old, and it's a bit grotty, so I thought I'd treat myself to a new one. I bought this PS Love Makeup Brush Kit because I wanted to try a bit more with brushes and see different ones, and they've got one I can see in there that would be good for my eyebrows, one for some eyeshadow, and one for face powder. I've got my little black one that I use for face powder, but it's getting a bit old and grotty, so I thought I'd get a new one. And seeing as the pack was only £3, if I don't like it, it's not a big deal. Um, because it's not that expensive. Next thing I've got is this, which is the Lovie Nature Hair Mask for dry hair. And I thought I'd try this out because I do get quite dry hair where I dye it all the time, it gets quite damaged. So I thought I'd try this and it says to put on after you've washed your hair um, with shampoo on towel dried hair and to let it sink in for five minutes then wash it off. So I will write about that probably on my Twitter about how that went or I might start a blog. but. I'll quite cheap only because of £1.50 so you can't really go wrong it's either going to condition your hair or it's not so I thought I'd try it out and if it's good I might go and get some more next thing I got was these three really really pretty nail varnishes they're only a pound each and I just thought that the colours were so pretty that you couldn't really give it a miss um, I really like this one which on camera looks a bit blue but in real life looks quite purple like a pastel purple and then you've got a bright pink and then a pastel green and I thought that's quite nice because um, I'm trying to get more adventurous in my nail varnishes and trying to put nail varnish on more often it's not going so well at the minute I have got these left um, where I bite off my nail varnish when I'm nervous and when I've got loads of stress going on so they've been all bitten off but I'm trying to not do it as much so only a pound each and they're very pretty colours and lastly as I've got a growing makeup collection, I've been buying things, I thought I would buy one of these, which is just a makeup bag. I was gonna get a zip, uh, a normal one like my old one, um, but I think this fits more space in and it'll be good as it's got quite a sturdy bottom. Um, I think it will be good to stack things in like my um, eyeshadow palettes and my foundations to keep them all upright. I will keep my everyday makeup in my um, normal makeup bag which is this one but as you can see it is a bit overflowing with things I thought if I put them all in this big beautiful box then I can see everything clearly as well and I can keep my everyday makeup in there for when I'm in a rush and then when I want to experiment I can just have a look through the box and see what I want and this only cost me five pounds which I think is really really good I think it's really pretty it's got a nice little bow on front and it's only five pounds so I think it's very good value for money Lastly, I went to Superdrug. 
I firstly went in there just for, with my friend to go and see what there was, but I got distracted, um, as per usual, and I thought I would give this a go, which is the Superstay Better Skin Foundation, and I'm going to do a review on it in the next week or two, so that will be up, you can have a look around for that. Um, I just wanted to try a new foundation, I'm, I've got a few now that I like, but I like to mix and match, depending on... Um, how high of coverage I want or how much shine or what kind of day it is um so I'm gonna try this one it's meant to last a long time and it's meant to um make your skin feel better so I will try that I also bought the new baby skin instant pore eraser I've heard so many good things about this and I wanted to try it seeing as Maybelline were doing a price promotion I think it was buy one get the second one half price I thought I would get this as well as the foundation um, so I'm saving a little bit of money but yeah I've heard really good things about this so I will let you know and lastly I tried the color rush what are they the color rush long-lasting intense color balm uh, um, and this one is number 120 all you need is pink which look which looks like that and this one which is 210 boom chicka boom um which looks like that um i just wanted to try these because i always go for a normal lipstick but apparently these are really good on your lips and they last a very long time so i will try these out i thought i'd try something new um because it might if it is very good it might become a staple in my everyday makeup bag just so i've got something always on the hand with me if i want to put something on my lips I could have bought a lot more, be proud of me that I didn't. My Primark basket was very full at one point and had to be like, think seriously, are you gonna use these? No. So I uh, emptied it all out, although I did find this. I don't know if you can see this, but they are chip and sauce socks. And I just thought, don't they remind you of Tyler Oakley? I might um, tag him on Tumblr or Twitter with it and see if he sees it. Because I just saw it and I just thought, Tyler Oakley, he would love them. He's got that pizza outfit, he might like the chips as well to go with it. Um, but yeah, that is all from me. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up or comment down below. Thanks for watching guys, bye.